my figure shit. Hey beautiful people, welcome or welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Nadia. Happy Saturday, you guys. Well, it's Friday for me, of course, but happy Saturday to you guys. I am so glad you're here. I'm glad to be here. I'm excited to record. As always, I have missed you guys. So before we get started, make sure you say hello down below in the comments so we can chat it up and talk over the weekend. Okay, so... I am excited about the tray. Again, I think I'm always excited about the tray. I'm really excited about the trays when you guys have a lot to do with the trays because I feel like we are sharing. Sharing is caring, you know? And y'all got some good noses too. Like the combos, I really be like, okay, yeah, this smell good. Oh yeah, this smell good. Okay, I know she smelled good when she wore this because it smelled good. <laughs> Like, that's really how I am when I start smelling you guys' combos. I feel like it connects us in some kind of way or whatever. But, um, we might not talk as much on this video because it is late. It's 7.15. I'm just not recording. I'm hot. I have been running. It's all good. This has been a great week for the most part. I'm trying to stay positive. Okay. This has been a great week or whatever. I can't really, I can't complain. Update on my swelling for those of you guys that y'all y'all know because I talked about it on the last video. So I went to my appointment and of course they had to establish my relationship with them. So they do, you know, your paperwork, ask you questions, do all of this. And since it's an allergy test that I'm having, I guess allergy tests have to be ordered or however they do that. So they couldn't like test me that day. So I still don't know yet what causing it well, like what has, was causing me to swell or anything like that. I'm not sure because they have to schedule my allergy test and all this kind of stuff. But when they were asking me examples and asking me what I had been eating or what I noticed that was like, if I paid attention to things that swelled me up, you know, that I was eating and stuff like that. So when I told them one of the things that I know for a fact swelled me up because I ate it one day and then because my coworker told me to try it like it's one of her favorite snacks. And even though it's something I shouldn't be eating, I was like, well, I'll just try it. I ate it. Swole up. Waited like four days later and I was like, maybe that was a coincidence. There's no way I swole up by just eating that. And so I ate it again. And I swole up again. Lip was fat. Eyes were puffy. So I was like, okay, absolutely not. I would never put this in my body again. <laughs> so I trashed it. So when I told the, the tech or whatever you call them at Alice's place, she could not wait to go tell the doctor what I had eaten or whatever that made me swole up. So as soon as he walks in the door, he opens the door. This is our first time ever seeing each other. He stands there with his hands in front of him. And he names and calls off like what I had been eating. And I just busted out laughing because I, I was like, I know. I said, it's so weird. And I know it sounds crazy. I was like, but you'd be so surprised. I said, it was so good. <laughs> I said, but I paid for it because my body does not want it inside of, of me. Okay. So, yeah. So, that's the update on my appointment. For those of you that care, one of the combos I kind of. And it gave me an idea of a shower routine that I want to do. So I think I'm going to do that routine this weekend and maybe put it out next week. But I'm really excited about the shower routine because it's one of my favorite types of scents. We started Saturday. What did I do Saturday? I went to the movies Saturday. I think. And I took a picture. Like this is what I wore Saturday. I went to the movie Saturday. I'm almost positive. And I took a picture of myself in the outfit even though I just like one of my friends um her birthday was Saturday and she wanted to go to see this movie so I was like if last week it's I was so screwed up with my days and my outfits and all that stuff and I was like this because I didn't take a picture of this day or this day or this day so I was like I need to take a picture regardless of what I have on so that I it can help me track my days and match my combinations like I said I went to the movies with one of my homegirls and this is a comfort this was a comfy movie was not trying to be cute i took a blanket and everything we went to see the exorcist it was okay very much you could just wait till it comes on the tv to watch it because it was it was okay but anyways i got to hang out with her so that was cool so that was my outfit so my combination came from tiffany washington 2599 or whatever so i screenshot y'all if I, I i will screenshot you guys combos and depending on what they are, I may not do them the week that you tell me. Like hers, I screenshot this. This is October the 1st or whatever. And I'm just now doing this combo because I need to... Sometimes I have to place them in certain places depending on what other combos that I'm going to have in that week. So, 
she Tiffany Washington said hi have you ever led them layered them we were talking about I was talking I must on the video had to be talking about just fluidity to gold and Catalan she was like I was told to lay down the Catalan first and top it with gentle fluidity gold I'm going to try it let me know if you or anyone reading this hat she's like I found Catalan to be heavier on the coriander it, it is not as sweet and smooth as the original but it is still good so my first thought when I saw them I was like okay they're the same but I know they have a slight difference in there and I guess like she said um Calhoun is heavier on the coriander so okay I'm gonna just tell y'all what I layered it with so I started with earrings I don't know when this bottle is gonna empty out it, it don't have an ending to it. I use it and it is still not an ending to it, but I am low on it. It is down here somewhere. So I started with Vanilla Cashmere from EOS and then I went on top of that with Way St. Bart's. Love it. I need a gallon of it. If you guys do not have St. Bart's, trust me, y'all need to get this. St. Bart's is so freaking good. When I find out, whenever they drop the perfume on it, I'm going to make sure to let y'all know to get it because that's how good it smells. They said they're coming out with a perfume on it. I told y'all that once before. So, I went in with, what did she say? Lay down Calhoun first. So, I, that's what I did. I laid down the Calhoun from Okja. Laid that down first. And then I went on top of it with Gentle Fluidity Cold. Y'all, I'm going to tell y'all right now. So two things, okay. If you don't have gentle fluidity gold, get it. And when you get it, don't buy this bottle size that I bought. This is what, 1.2? Yeah, 1.2. This is definitely big bottle worthy. I want to stop wearing this because I am getting close to half a bottle. It makes me want to stop wearing it. It's like, I don't want to wear that anymore because my bottle... So I feel like, like, like I was saying, my bottle is almost halfway there. And y'all probably like, Nadia, well, that's still a good bit. Not for this. Because when I spray this, I spray. And this is a strong perfume. So <clears throat> it does not take, take a lot. But it is gorgeous. Like, anytime I spray this, I cannot help but to, like, spray heavily on it. Because it smells so good and it does not come off as too strong. So, Calhoun smells good too. Like, really, really good. And you can tell, definitely, it tell what Calhoun is supposed to be. Even if you were to smell it on, like, a blind nose. If you knew what this smelled like and you smell somebody wear this, you would know. You would know that they're the same thing. So, I tend to wear Calhoun to work or whatever because I don't want to be spraying up my good, good girlfriend over here going to work. Because, I want to say this size is like $140. When this is gone, I am going to get the big bottle of this. I cannot not have it. It is that freaking good. So it did work. Like spraying these two together, you could actually tell that they were I like that I had both of them on. And you could separate the differences in the sense. It was crazy. I wasn't really shocked because like I said, there's a teensy weensy bit of a difference. Enough that you can tell that it's a different fragrance, but they smell still smell so so much alike. Combo 1010. Anything with gentle fluidity gold is a 10-10, baby. That perfume smells good. If you don't have it in your collection, I'm telling you, you are missing out. I know it's not cheap, so if you prefer to order the Calhoun from Okja to see what it smells like, I get it. But trust me, you need one of them. I was off. I, I, I realized how much I say so. I'm, I'm, edit, I'm gonna, I edited it out of the last video I did. I'm going to have to edit them out again. Me saying so, like starting every sentence with so. Okay, so, okay, so I'm getting on my own nerve. <laughs> so, <laughs> Monday, okay, we were closed Monday. And so, see, Tuesday, this is my outfit from Tuesday. And Tuesday's combination came from, where you at, where you at, where you at, girl? All right, so. Stop, Nadia. It's crazy what you notice when you record yourself on video and then you look back and you're like, I didn't realize I said that word so much. I don't think I say it as much in person, but I definitely say it a lot on these videos. I guess because I'm constantly restarting phrases. Tuesday's combination. I almost said it again. <laughs> Tuesday's combination came from 
London Thomas 7612. Hey London! Alright, so the two you have next to each other smell bone together. Prada and uh, Poison Girl. Wearing it today and the customer keep, customers keep asking what am I wearing? Well, as soon as I read your comment saying that you did that, I was like, yes, because I know they smell good. I love Prada. I love Hair Grease Poison Girl. <laughs> they smell so good together. I was like, yep, I'm doing it. I immediately put it, screenshot it, and was ready to wear because I knew those were going to smell good together. So I started my combination with Life of the Party. Yes, ma'am. All right. And then I just left it there and I went in with Prada first and then I put Poison Girl on top. When I tell you guys that this smells so good together, y'all know I always say Poison Girl smells like Blue Magic Hair Grease, but it's good. I love it. <laughs> it smells so good and y'all already know at this point what Prada, oh my God, Prada smells so good. Prada is big bottle worthy. Prada is like Valentino Born in Roma. Don't tease yourself and get this little small bottle like I did. Go ahead and get the big bottle because, baby, it is definitely worth it. It has gotten better just sitting here on the tray this week. Poison Girl, y'all talk about it, but y'all see how much I done used the Poison Girl. Poison Girl smells so good. This was a blind buy, and I don't see a lot of people talking about Poison Girl. Even, even It's an older perfume, but even with the collations that we have, I don't see a lot of people talking about Poison Girl. And maybe it's not a bougie enough for them to say me. I don't know. <laughs> Anyways, moving on. Okay, so this is Wednesday's outfit. I love a good blazer. It's getting colder. Well, not colder here because we're in the south, so it'll probably be 95 degrees next week. Who knows? Anyways, getting cooler here. We have had some cool days, so I, put, I pulled some of my blazers out, some of my sleeveless blazers. My co-worker was like, Nadia, your blazer don't have no sleeves. <laughs> the one I wore that, uh, what, Tuesday. I was like, jacket with no sleeves <laughs> he was like I don't think I've ever seen that before <laughs> but I got so many of them because I love them but anyway so like I said that was my outfit and Wednesday's combination started with EOS Jasmine Peach all right all right and then we went in with Nishan May 100 Silent Ways hold on hold on hold on hold on hold on hold on Wednesday's combination shout out came from McKelvey McKelvey 6299. My bad, let me back that up. So, like I said, Jasmine Peach EOS. We went in with Nishan A, 100 Silent Ways. McKelvey gave me a list. Quite a few of y'all gave me like bullet points, list of, of combinations. So, I'm going to do them over the weeks or whatever. So, I'm, some of these screenshots I'm having to say. Anyways, 100 Silent Ways. And then, good girl. Yes, ma'am, Pam. Y'all know where I get that from? I think I got that from Martin when I be saying that. <laughs> but this smells so good. Again, if everybody, y'all can find this, y'all know what this smells like at this point. If you don't have 100 Silent Ways in your collection, you are missing out. Don't get the size bottle that I got. Get the big bottle. When I say that, that means I probably blind bought it. Prada, I didn't blind bought it by that, but I still just bought the small bottle. This, I blind bought it. That's why I have this size bottle, but the other one is fatter and it comes back like this. Definitely will be my next one because this is the bomb. And I dropped it the other day in my kitchen on that hard floor. Y'all know I was sick because I thought my bottle was about to shatter. Whoo! Sick as a dog. Thank God it did not. Oh, let me get something to show y'all. Where we at? We're on Thursday. So, this was Thursday's outfit and Thursday's combination. All right. So, I randomly was in Walmart, like last week. And I was walking through and I was like, I needed another lotion. Didn't I say I was not going to buy another lotion? But I wanted another, like, basic, everyday type lotion, something I could put on during the day, something I want to put on during, like, when I would get out of the shower. And my intentions on buying this lotion was to use this lotion as a base to go underneath my scented lotions, my body creams. Y'all probably like really not your overkill. Y'all, I tried it and it worked. Like, 
the lotion is because in, in my mind I was like so say for instance the EOS if I put the EOS on my skin is dry it's gonna soak that up and then the scent won't last long it'll just be sitting there is I guess it's the whole process of layering like we already do but I normally don't layer two lotions or two body creams or anything like that but I bought this Nivea essentially enriched with deep nourishing serum and almond oil they only had it in this big one this big one was like seven dollars and fifty cents Y'all I know I y'all know I love anything that smells like almond. And then I love Nivea. Nivea is old school, but Nivea smells so freaking good. I've been using it to wear it to bed every at night. I've been I've been layering it underneath some of my lotions and body creams and stuff like that. So Thursday, when I started my combination, I actually started it with this. And then I went on top of it. Let me give Thursday a shout out. So before I tell y'all about that. Thursday's combo shout out goes to Dr. Aisha. She said, put Mont Blanc signature with Burberry Goddess on your list too. I put Brown Sugar Babe, Angel of Mine, Angel Share oil on first and then she put the Latin face. Okay, so like I said, I started Thursday with this, all right? The Essentially Enriched, this is good. It's kind of heavy though. But baby, the glow that I have on my skin after I use this and it sticks, yes ma'am all right so i started with that and then i went on top of it with carol's daughter the almond cookie frappe lotion so both of these smells like almond <laughs> but yeah so i went on top uh, first second and then so the way she did her combo she said that she like she said she put on brown sugar babe angel of mine which is angel share body oil i do not have that so i tweaked it so that i could still kind of get the scent that she had so i started mine with the actual angel share perfume gorgeous bottle i love it and i was like i didn't realize like i be using using this i need to chill out because this was not cheap y'all this smells so darn good but this is an extremely boozy fragrance this is not blind by safe if you don't mind boozy fragrances you would mind this but this this is not a safe blind buy it smells amazing but this is not a safe blind buy but um so i started with, with angel shares perfume and then i put she said put mont blanc signature so i went in on top of that with mont blanc and then i went on top of that with burberry goddess i told y'all to stop giving me recommendations with this because it's almost gone because <laughs> i'm gonna have to rebuy it and then I looked at my phone and some of the screenshots and I have so many recommendations with this perfume. But I'm like, my goodness, I'm going to have to come up off my no buy so I can rebuy it. Let me stop. <laughs> but yeah, so that was Dr. Aisha's um, combo. Y'all, when I tell y'all this, man, the weather here was perfect because it was cool. This combination smelled so good and it carried so well. When I tell you, smell delectable. I absolutely loved it. It smells so freaking good. I was like, oh my God. I kept smelling myself like, oh my God, I smell so good. Angel Share with Mont Blanc. Oh my eye twitched, that hurt. And Burberry Goddess with all these almonds and almond cookies. Yeah, it smelled good. Good, 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 good. All right, and today, which is Friday, this is Friday's, uh, this is actually a dress. <laughs> this is a dress, but I have to wear it like a dress shirt because it's too short to wear just as a dress. As you can see where it comes on my thighs, like I cannot wear this as just a dress, even though on the picture when I ordered it, that's what that she was wearing it as a dress. Absolutely not, I cannot do that because it's too short. But this is a dress or whatever. So yeah, as you guys can see, I did not have a lipstick all week this week. I, I prepped one. I actually put one in my purse to start the week off Tuesday to wear one. And it is still in my purse. I never did wear Because <laughs> I like to put my lipstick on after I drink my protein shake. And it's taken me all morning lately to drink my freaking protein shake. So it's like, oh well. You know, I just wear it tomorrow. And then tomorrow come and I don't wear it. And then tomorrow come and I don't wear it. So it's like, so yeah, so no lipstick this week, but you still, we still got outfits. Okay, so Friday's combination, I started with Dahlia. Ooh. All right, 
one of you gave me a combination with this and something else but I didn't do that combination combination yet because that perfume was already in another combination here so I'll be you know, like I said I'm going to be spreading them around so we started with Thalia and then I went in with <laughs> Givenchy perfume oh my god I cannot wait to tell y'all the dupe that I found for this because it is so good of course I've had this for a long time but then blind bought the other perfume and realized that it was dupe for this can't wait to tell y'all what it is but yeah so we started this and then we went in with Boche Viva y'all this combination smells so good like this is I always say that I'm not a scent like a seasonal scent wearer but this is definitely like cold weather approved like I, I think I've worn this before and I wore it when it was warm and it smelled good but it's definitely something that is like that you would want to smell in the colder weather it smells so good like it is such a strong powerful combination yes smelled good this week again gym scent was the same <laughs> I am literally this little corner of this cherry smash and I almost want to wait to use this because I think one of the combinations you guys gave me had lost cherry and baccarat in the combination separately and I don't have lost cherry but I have baccarat dupes but then I have this 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 cherry smash this this is a combination of the two so I'm gonna have to go back and read my things my screenshot so I can see if I can utilize the rest of this in your combination because I'm almost positive that this will work in the combination but yeah so this was my gym scent for the days that i did go this week because i'm not lazy this week i'm not even gonna lie but i'm getting it together over the weekend so i can get my tail back in the gym all week next week all right so and then bedtime scents for the days that i didn't go to bed ash year and i actually put on a combination we did carol's daughter the almond cookie lotion again and then i went in with the barbecue rouge extract this perfume this perfume is supposed to be the um baccarat um 540 straight version this one is and this is also on my amazon storefront y'all know i have this regular one and i have this one so that was my combination for bedtime and it wasn't overpowering because of how it smells but yeah so this again was another good smelling week you guys so thank you to all of you guys who gave me recommendations and that I've used or screenshots that I have that I have not used yet because it's a lot of them so like I said I'm kind of spreading them out and doing what I you know to put them where I need to put them to make them fit or whatever so yeah yeah I like my ponytail my little doo doo bow <laughs> this is how we rocked our hair all week because I was like okay I've been wearing the puff for months and it's like I love my puff but I'm trying to wear my natural hair and trying to keep it out of a ponytail so that's why I was kind of sick about the fact that I was like I didn't feel like doing my hair so I was like I'm just gonna slick it back in a bun it's professional it it, it works okay <laughs> but I miss my braids I said I was trying to wait till my birthday to get my hair braided but whew, I'm struggling okay but yeah so that's the end of the combinations for this week you guys I hope y'all enjoyed this video as always, leave me some comments down below. Of course, leave your layering recommendations down below because I know y'all are getting recommendations from each other. It's, re it's really a family over here. Where we having our reunion? <laughs> but thank y'all so much. I appreciate you guys more than you know. As always, if you made it this far, leave me a royal blue heart. Tell me happy Saturday because I'm telling y'all happy Saturday. Thank you guys so much. I appreciate you guys so, 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 so much. I hope y'all have an amazing weekend before you leave. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. And I will see you guys Sunday for my big announcement. Yeah. <laughs> Bye, guys. <laughs>